Yo, what's up guys, Ravi, and today we got some guys a Madden 17 head-to-head -head season game, and we're going to be taking a look at Ladarius Webb Season Star 95 overall. So he's got the deep defender and lockdown chemistry. It's the main reason why I got him. He's got 93 speed, 93 excel, 92 play recognition, 73 tackling. Mm. 93 man coverage, 97 zone coverage, 80 pursuit, and 76 hit power. So that seems like a really good card, especially with the lockdown and deep defender chemistries. But I think the next person we're going to be getting is going to be the limited time Sam Shields, and we're going to throw him at corner. And uh, because I believe he has deep defender chemistry, which is going to help out a shite ton. And then I think we're going to throw Antonio Cromartie into backup, and then whatever happens after that. So, uh, Let's hop into this game and hopefully we can get ourselves a win. Alright, we got the ball first and we got to get something going on the first drive. I mean, we can't come out of this drive not getting any points, dude. We need to get something as we're going to get it to Ozzie Newsom up to the 38-yard line. I'm really liking this playbook because it's just fitting so well with Matt Ryan. But trying to get it to Zeke as he's going to get through the line there. Alright, here we go, second and 13. It's all good. We got to get something going, though. We got to get something going. We got to get something going. Zeke. Come on, Zeke. Get. Let's go. Mountain halfback swing. I don't know if I've said this before, but in Madden 16, I loved this play because this play was cheese, but it was only cheese when people block. Also, I want to get Julio Jones as well. I don't know if I've said that already. I mean, I said that as soon as the gosh darn card came out. But I want to get him soon. I don't know why I chose this play. I don't think I'm really going to like this play. I don't think it's going to get anything going for us. But we're going to try it anyways. You got to try new plays, man. You 100% do as we're going to get to Deion Sanders here. Up to the 27-yard line. Here we go. First and 10. Got to keep focus. Got to keep focus. Get it to Zeke as we're going to. Going to move up. Oh, he's breaking tackles. Up to the 12-yard line. All right, first and 10. We're going to try a little bit of a screen here. Hopefully, we don't throw a pick. Please don't throw a pick. He does not know we're doing a screen, but that could have been a touchdown. All right, here we go. Second and 11. Let's get some yards here. I'm not asking for a touchdown here, but uh, let's get some yards. Going to get it to X. Into All right, we got to take a shot here. We got to take a shot here at the end zone. We got to get in that end zone, dude. We got to get in that end zone. We got to get in that end zone. And this is intercepted, but they'll say out of bounds. I'm taking my point. All right, man, let's see if we can force this guy to do things he does not want to do. That's what you want to do every time you come out onto the field. That's what you always want to do as he's going to get it out to Julian Edelman for a eight-yard game. All right, second and two. He's got two tight ends on the field. If he does not run the ball, then I don't know what he's going to be doing the entire game. But there is Webb trying to make people to fumble. Don't underestimate him. He might have, like... 71 hit power, but don't underestimate him, man. Don't underestimate him whatsoever, as he's going to run the ball once again. Going to get no gain. All right, here we go. Let's see what they got going on here. I got Brian Urlacher. He's up deep, but he's going to take a small pass, and he's going to get a one-yard loss. Third and 11. Let's go, baby. Come on. We need a big stop here. We need a big stop here. Let's see what he's going to do. Let's see if he's going to try to force anything. Let's see if he's going to try to force anything, but we're going to get the sack. Let's go, baby. There you go, first and ten. Let's get something going in a different formation. Gonna hit. Man, last play. That was that would have been a giant gain, but it. Oh my gosh, that was horrible. I can't believe that just happened. Can't believe that just happened. Gonna hit wide to Sean Jackson with the aggressive catch, getting the first down. Move the chains. I don't want to throw any interceptions in this video. Um, I probably just jinxed myself. I'm probably about to throw one right now, Ozzy. Let's go. Got he. We go first and ten. Gonna try running the ball. Catch him on his toes here. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. That was freaking close, dude. I ain't even gonna lie. I'm glad he freaking dropped that pick. As we're gonna hit Antonio Brown with the possession catch. Getting up to 47 yards. See if we can catch him off guard here with a run. And uh, it's green. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. Green. That's what I like to see. As we're not our hole is not opening up whatsoever on plays it should be opening up but that's fine you gotta deal with the bad things dude you gotta deal with the bad things as we're gonna hit martellus ben 
Timeout. Oh, I hope this play works, dude. I really hope this play works. We're gonna make Tyreek Hill go deep. Cause I feel like we can get something happening with him. But, uh, oh, come on, someone's gotta come down. Tyreek, Tyreek, come back down. There you go. Let's go. <laughs> that was just luck. I'm not even gonna lie, that was just luck. But let's not be stupid here. Let's actually try to do something here with these points. Throw it away. Come on, stop lagging, dude. Are you freaking kidding me? Don't even do that. I wanna get one of these screens to work. Because if we get it to work, it's gonna be key. Especially in this area of the end zone. Come on, come on, come on, Z. Come on, come on. Moving up for the first down. Getting out of bounds. Let's go. Here we go. First and goal. Come on, baby. First and goal. Come on. Get it to Ozzie Newsom. And he's not going to get anywhere. It's timeout. Oh, he's calling timeouts. Okay. Come on, man. We got to get in this end zone. We got to get up by two points. Two scores. That's 100% the task. Martell has been getting in the end zone for the touchdown. We're up. Two scores. Let's go, baby. All right, let's see what he's doing here. He's in this formation. To see if he's no. He's not running the ball. He's not running the ball at all. Let's see what he's doing. He's gonna be passing here. Let's see what he's gonna do. He's gonna throw it. We are hit sticking this guy so much. I'm not in the right defensive formation, but I feel like we'll be fine. I got stuck on a defensive lineman, and he's gonna do what I thought he was gonna do. Gonna get it to Chris Hogan. I don't think he this guy's running the ball anymore, so watch him run the ball now. I mean I got okay, yep, yep, he is running the ball. That's a good thing. There we go. Gonna make a stop. He's gonna get like eight yards. Not really sure if he's going with the same play here or what, because he's in the same formation. Third and three, he might be running the ball. He's not running the ball whatsoever. And he's gonna throw it to Julian Edelman over the middle. Big game. Oh, I know what he's doing here. I 100% know what he's doing here. He's doing his little out routes here. He's going to throw it out to Travis Kelsey. I knew what he was doing, but I couldn't make a stop. All right, second and two. Let's see what he does here. Looks like he's going to be running the ball, but we are going to make a big stop. Let's go. All right, we got the hard flop, so we should be good here with whatever play he decides to do. And he's got that play again. All right, I think I know exactly what time, type of guy we're playing against. A guy that runs the same plays pretty much over and over again until it gets stopped. Throw, throw your dumb crap at me that you think is going to work. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Do it. I dare you. I dare you to throw it. I dare you to throw it. I dare you to throw it. I dare you. I dare you. Get Randall. All right, we're playing the run. We're playing the run, so okay. He might be doing a counter here, but I highly doubt it. Yup, he's going to run, and we're not going to make a stop. Come on, dude. I don't care what formation you're in, dude. You're running the ball. I'm not dumb. I'm not okay. Are you not running the ball? Okay. All right, he's got two running backs on the field. So if he's not running the ball, I'm going to be very surprised. He's not running the ball. He's not. He's going to have his tight end wide fucking open. All right, we're going to run the ball here first play just to get something going here. Just so we can get something going before the second half. Zeke getting up to the 31 yard line. Alright, second and four. This is the point in time of the game where we gotta run that clock out, dude. We gotta run that clock out. 100%, dude. And we're gonna hit X over the middle. That's Antonio Brown hanging on. Let's go. Here we go. First and 10, baby. Come on, Zeke. Come on, Z. Come on, throw the ball. I hate that fucking play when you press Y and it doesn't throw the ball. I don't understand. That's like literally how the AI plays. They they do that and they take forever to run a play like that. To like throw the ball and stuff like that. And it just makes no sense because you're literally showing exactly what you're doing. And it makes no sense. Going to hit Ozzy Newsom here. Getting up to the 46-yard line. All right, third and five. This is a big third down here, dude. This is a big third down. We 100% need to convert here. Going to hit uh, Deion Sanders once again. Getting up to the 48-yard line. Fourth and three, dude. You think I'm afraid? You think I'm afraid to go for it here? Going to hit Ozzy New. Oh, yeah. As long as the game just doesn't screw us over here and allow him to dink and, duck down, dink and dunk down the field when he runs the same plays, we should be perfectly fine. We should be perfectly fine as he's going to run the ball there with Jamal Charles and get about a three-yard gain. All right, second and seven, and we have the right defense for this play that he's about to do. He's about to do the stupid little corn. He threw it a lot earlier than I expected him to do there on that play. Please run the ball here, dude. Please run the ball here. 
I really need you to run the ball for me. Thank you very much, but our defense is just going to choke. Defense just chokes too much in these situations where I think I have the right play to stop something, and I just don't. It screws me over 100% as he's going to get it to Jamal Charles. We need a big hit stick here. Dude, I swear to God. I swear, dude. Don't. Thank you. We made a stop. All right, Tampa 2, here we go. Just in case if he runs the ball, we got a 4-3 defense going on. A 4-3 defense. Let's see what he's going to do. Attack him. You're lucky. Fourth down. He's going for it on fourth down. I don't know what this guy's thinking. Why he would... Oh, I know what he's doing. I know what he's doing. He's about to get a first down. He's... Motherfucker. Can we not be the Atlanta Falcons right now, please? Like, this seriously annoys the living hell out of me. We're, we're in a situation where we should not be in. And he's going to start no huddling. So, I'm going to get a cover two press going on. Hopefully that works out and makes a stop. He's going to run no huddle, running the ball, and he's going to get up to the seven yard line. I don't have faith in my user right now, so we're just going to, you know, we're just going to use a defensive lineman, see how it goes here. He's going to throw it. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh, that seriously annoys me, dude. I really thought we had the chance to win there, especially on that fourth down he decided to go for. But uh, it's all good, man. You have your wins and you have your losses. I'm just going to throw it up. <laughs> I was not expecting Dion to come up with that. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. This was 100% a game we could have won. won. Um, but uh, that one fourth down we went to, one four on. Um, I definitely should have done a high pass to uh, who I was throwing it to on that fourth down that he was doing. Um, that was just a giant risk for him to throw it where he threw it. So uh, props to him. He won the game. We've lost like two, three games in a row. I need to bring you guys a gameplay of us winning. But either way, I still hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, homies.